Many of Australia's large cities are situated on coastlines. Living near the beach has become a highly desired lifestyle, but it's hard to believe that at our doorstep, beyond the rolling waves, is an abundance of marine species tucked away beneath the surface. But there's one problem. We share this environment with an animal that is grossly misunderstood. Due to strong media influence, society has been falsely misled to believe sharks, as a whole species, are mindless killing machines. While they are apex predators and may appear to look quite menacing, out of nearly 400 species worldwide, only a handful are considered dangerous. In fact, due to human intervention, a lot of species are now in trouble and global food chains are being turned upside down because shark populations are dramatically declining. One of these species is the grey nurse shark. During the winter months and in some areas year round, grey nurse sharks can be seen off the Australian coast. Like many other sharks, grey nurse sharks are timid, harmless and amazing animals to dive with. They are also critically endangered along the east coast of Australia. Estimates sit at approximately 1,500 individuals. A huge factor in this severe decline is the dramatic overfishing of these sharks between the 1950s and 1970s. They were targeted and deliberately caught because people were frightened of their appearance. It was an easy task because grey nurse sharks appear slow and placid. Today, they still face the threat of illegal or accidental fishing. Often, they are found with large hooks lodged in their mouths, which may prevent the shark from feeding properly. Grey nurse sharks are also slow to reproduce and usually breed once every two years. Males will bite the female to mate with her, which may explain the scarring seen on some. After a 9 to 12 month gestation, females generally give birth to two pups, one from each of the shark's two wombs. Grey nurse sharks have been a protected species for over 30 years now and they still have a long way to recovery. But if we can dispel the overall fear factor of sharks and understand their importance in our ecosystems, then we might be on track to helping these beautiful animals get the treatment they deserve. Music